beautifuls, this is Avromi here and welcome back to Cooking Mama's Sweet Shop. So today we are actually making Zuccato, which I have no idea what that is. But I am learning all these desserts every day. So it's quite interesting because the honey toast yesterday really surprised me. Oh, let's break all these. Ugh, I already know I'm not going to like this dessert because it's full of nuts. But it's okay. Doesn't mean you guys can't like it. The weird thing is, when I was little, my dad would buy me peanuts all the time. Like the one you can like pop open and shell by yourself. So I think like when I was that age, I loved it a lot. And now that I'm older, it's just like, ugh. Like I had too much of it. Like I had my life, life's worth of peanuts and nuts in general. So I was like, yeah, I'm good. Which is good in a way, because nuts are really expensive, so I'm glad I'm not like a huge fan of them. I know Tyler is, he's a huge fan of cashew nuts, so his grandma would get him a tin can of it every year for Christmas, and it's gone by like a couple days. Because <laughs> it's just a rare treat for him. I, now I'm, I'm wondering like, what's a rare treat for me? What do I love so much that I can't have? This is going by really fast. So. Oh, shit. Oh, really? Just splashed on my face, by the way. Right here. I like chocolate and vanilla. Pretty sure it's not, though. Okay. Ooh, I need to sneeze. Okay, sneeze done. Oh, this is a different colored one. This one's a bit darker. Oh, is this the wrapping? It is. Ta-da! Awesome job, Mama! Next. Yo, I sneezed on my game. My Nintendo screen, ew. <laughs> oh, we're just sliding it in, alright. Oh, nope. That's not No, oh, it actually went slow for me. What the hell? Looks like, um, a melon. <laughs> They're pretty though, how do you do that? You will need like the perfect bowl, though. You know what this reminds me of? Um, that- oh, that's thick. Ew. What is this? Look at it, it just like drops like it's a very thick like mashed potato or something, I don't know. Reminds me of um, the chocolate filled uh, balls, like you, you, they light it up in front of you or melt it with that uh, the chocolate syrup and then it's like, oh look! That's what it reminds me right now, but I feel like that's spreading. bread, right? It's not something, it's, it's not something sweet. We're almost done, actually. I'm really, oh, I really want to look this up now. Oh god, it's escaped. Oh, oh. Gentle, gentle touches. Refrigerator, we go. Okay, goes in the freezer. All right. Interesting. What is this zu zucato? Okay, we gotta beat it out of the thing now. Is that what's going on? Oh, it's just tapping again. Oh, 
Oh, it bounced. I can't wait to look it up. One more. Got one more to go. That was fun. It's like... <laughs> just one after the other. That's pretty cool. Okay, now we get to see what it actually looks like. I can't wait. I can't wait. What is this? Whoa. It looks like a fancy bread to me. Fancy cream filled bread. I don't know what it looks like. That looks like breading details, but here are pictures of it in real life. Uh, I can't wait to actually see it when I look it up. It's quite interesting. I don't think I've ever seen this before. I'm not quite sure uh, what country this dessert comes from, but it's definitely not a country that I know of. If you guys have tried this, please tell me. I love finding out if you guys tried certain desserts yet or not. It makes me like. I don't know, I, I feel like I knew you one step closer. Because <laughs> I know a lot of you told me you have tried the baked cheesecake and that was really good. Someone said that, oh, someone's here. Someone someone said that there's one, there, there is one at Starbucks. I hardly go to Starbucks though, but if I do, maybe I'll go look at it. Hello? Who's here? Who are you? Hello? Sweets in the shop looks quite appetizing. Good day, I'm the sweets madam. Whoa. Are you like a food critic? Sweets madam, a wealthy woman traveling in the world in search of delicious sweets. Her dream is to find sweets she likes and promote them globally. If the madam likes your sweets, your shop might expand across the world. Oh, you have this sweet in your shop. Oh, it seems you don't. How unfortunate. Oh, you jerk. I wanted to taste the sweets you've made. I'll have to come back sometime. Well, I don't know how to make a freaking cupcake for you, woman. Chance to go to Google with your shop. Well, do, how, how is that going to work? Like... Oh, do, oh, do. Now I get the cupcake? Now I get the cupcake that you wanted. Oh, how convenient. How convenient, Cooking Mama. How convenient. Really convenient of you. I will not be able to make that till next week, so she has to sit her little fancy self down and wait for her stupid cupcake. I had all this other selection, but she wanted a stupid, simple cupcake. Are you serious? Are you serious? Madam S Sweet Lady Ma Sweet what? I don't even remember her name. <laughs> I don't even remember her name. Oh well, whatever. But... That is it for today's episode. That was quite interesting. I didn't know you can unlock um, characters coming in, busting in your doors, and be like, Hey, I want this tweet. Where is it? So, when do I even get to sell it to her? Is she going to be walking around the store until there is a cupcake? I'm not too sure. I haven't even touched... I haven't even, like, gained any money going through the store since the last time I showed you that I have, like, this much uh, money on me. I don't know how the customers are gonna look around, especially if all the food items are all stacked up on top of each other now. I don't know, we're gonna figure that out whenever, after I make that cupcake for her and throw it in that shop and see if she buys it. But anyway, thank you guys for watching, stay beautiful, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.